Welcome back to the Internet. My name is Tyler, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a sky dome light and how to put an HDR photo in it so you can make all of your uh, models look super good. So, first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to here to Arnold. I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to hit lights. We're going to hit sky dome light. So, here we go. This is what shows up giant dome. So, what we're going to do, we're going to come over to this right side. We're going to go down to the attribute editor here and we are going to click on color so this opens up there's a little thing called a rendering node so what we're going to do is we're going to hit file so it's going to disappear now because it is currently just black there's nothing selected so we're going to come over here to this right side again we're going to hit this little folder so now this is what it's going to do is it's going to look for a file that is compatible with the actual uh, sky dome light itself so i have a set of HDR photos. So uh, these are all photos uh, you can get off of offline. This is what the website's called. It's called HDR uh, Haven, HDRI Haven. And so literally just go to the top and then you can literally just, there are so many of these and these are all free to download. So yeah. So I have already downloaded some of these. So let's say I want to see this. Uh, let's do like side. So we select it, and so now, as you can see, uh, the HDR, HDRI photo has been loaded, and uh, now what we need to do is we need to make this uh, view set into Arnold. So what I'm gonna do, just to make it a little bit nicer looking, I'm gonna assign a, a new material. So we're gonna do into AI standard surface, and then we'll do a preset, we'll do this brushed metal, excuse me, so here we go, and now here comes the magic. Boom. And boom. Once this renders. And so this is what our uh, actual cube looks like, and with this brush metal, it reflects all the lighting. And so the HDR photos, they um, record the actual lighting from the image, and so that's why uh, this lighting is so accurate. As you can see, even from like um, the lighting up here bounces off the cube and yeah that's about it so thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed we'll see you guys on the next video